One of the things about the Layout Overlay tool that isn't particularly obvious is that there are some options for it. And I'm going to show you here what those are. Essentially, it's your Control key on the PC and the Command key over on the Mac. Under the View menu, you enable the overlay by first choosing an image and here I'm going to pick this one called Vincent. That automatically switches on the overlay and this is a transparent uh, file, a PNG file, which I had created earlier in Photoshop and you may have briefly seen uh, something flashing up saying hold control for options. And that's going to be the key to this. Hold the control key or the command key if you're on the Mac. I'm doing so now and you can see that I've got some controls down at the bottom. If, for example, I want to completely hide the rest of the image or display it much more obviously, I can do so by changing the mat value. And I can do the same sort of thing with my uh, transparency itself, my uh, layout. Additional tools, though, are that when you hold the control key on the PC or the command key on the Mac, you can start changing the dimensions of the overlay. Secondly, notice how it's turned to a hand. That means I can move it around. So effectively I'm cropping on the fly. And at some stage you might then want to reset it to how it was originally. You keep your control key held down, command key again if you're on the Mac, and just double click and it resets the overlay. Those options aren't very obvious but I think they're really worth knowing.